Yakovlev and the Moscow Institute of Electromechanics and Automation have created Automatic Flight Control System AFCS, algorithms for the new SJ-100 aircraft. Previously, this system was a component of a more comprehensive suite offered by Liebherr Aerospace in the Superjet SSJ-100 and included cockpit controls, side stick controllers, and a variety of actuators for the aircraft's control surfaces. The Russian-built AFCS offers both automatic and director mode flight control, which allows the system to generate commands for the pilot to execute. The AFCS offers guidance cues to pilots in director mode, enabling them to manually control the aircraft while receiving real-time feedback on the necessary adjustments to maintain the intended flight path. This mode is especially beneficial in challenging circumstances or during complex maneuvers. Additionally, it regulates engine thrust. The AFCS is equipped with an auto throttle system that automatically adjusts engine thrust in accordance with the intended airspeed established by the flight management system. This feature is indispensable for optimizing fuel efficiency and sustaining consistent speed during flight. The Comprehensive Control System, CCS, will incorporate this new development. The objective of this integration is to improve the overall functionality of aircraft systems by offering a unified interface for the management of a variety of control elements. The CCS will enable the AFCS and other onboard systems to communicate more effectively, resulting in enhanced coordination throughout the entire flight. According to Yakovlev, the algorithms that have been developed are comparable to those implemented in current passenger aircraft that allow functions such as director mode takeoff and entirely automatic control during all other flight phases. The automatic landing algorithms that comply with CAT-3B standards are a critical component of the new system. The instrument landing system classifications include Category 3B standards, which allow aircraft to land in extremely low visibility conditions. Pilots may lack the necessary visual references to manually ground the aircraft, necessitating the implementation of an automatic landing system during CAT-3B operations. The system must guarantee that the aircraft can land and roll out on the runway in a secure manner. According to Yakovlev, these algorithms facilitate automatic control during flare and touchdown, as well as the aircraft's alignment with the runway centerline. Pilots implement the flare maneuver just prior to touchdown during the landing process. It adjusts the aircraft's attitude and decreases its descent rate to facilitate the transition from the final approach to a secure landing. The aircraft's descent is slowed by flare, which also facilitates a seamless touchdown. Pilots can prevent hard landings by increasing lift and decreasing the rate of descent by raising the tip of the aircraft. Kirill Kuznetsov, chief designer of the SJ-100, said, We have successfully conducted preliminary tests of the AFCS, which was implemented within the CCS, using the electronic bird integration stand with the assistance of test pilots and engineers. Kirill added that the subsequent phase involves the installation of the system on aircraft and the completion of flight tuning and certification tests. Yakovlev specialists are using mathematical models to perform statistical modeling of automated landings for CAT-3A and CAT-3B categories as part of the SJ-100 certification. The experiments will simulate more than 2 million landings with randomized initial conditions. The objective of this modeling is to verify that the autonomous landing algorithms satisfy the specifications specified in aviation regulations. Superjets provides shuttle services to the airports of adjacent friendly countries including Armenia, Turkey, Kazakhstan, Uzbekistan, and Kyrgyzstan. Additionally, they operate within the country. The planes can fly to Vietnam and the Philippines from the eastern part of Russia. Now, do you think this integration and testing will push SJ-100 delivery timelines further? Let us know in the comments. Please like and share our videos and subscribe to our channel. Please also take membership in our channel to encourage us.